First cheers of the girls trip. Cheers! cheers. <laughs> High and dry, trying hey. to shake a little tail feather. With no. these knock knees shaking down here in Mexico. <laughs> One thing for she gonna do is pose and good. she gonna twerk. She gonna pose in that order. <laughs> It's your girl Jay. I'm back. Um, I am prepping for a girls trip. So today I woke up y'all not feeling real well. So I didn't even go to work. Um, I kind of laid in bed and kind of stayed around the house, but I'm feeling a little bit better. Um, I've been having a little bit of challenges with my health. So I never disclosed to you guys prior to YouTube and any of this happening. The reason I complain about joint pain and knee pain and all that um, so much is because I do have issues with that. So um, after my knee surgeries, my orthopedic doctor recommended that I see a rheumatologist um, just to ensure I didn't have like rheumatoid arthritis and things like that, which causes your joints to shift, especially because I have this bone here. Can y'all see that? This bone here that sticks out of my clavicle bone. Um, they wanted to operate here, but my orthopedic surgeon got scared because it's too close to my heart. And he was saying I have to have a cardiologist in the room because we're talking about bone. If I puncture your aorta, aorta then I will have to, um, we can have big problems. So needless to say, I elected not to have the surgery and it's there. So sometimes I get pain in that area and everything, but I just get joint pain that comes um, unprovoked and I don't even know when it's coming. So that's the, I guess, the frustrating part about all of this because like one morning I woke up and my foot was so swollen, it was in my toe. I was like, that's a crazy place for it to be, but my foot was so swollen that I couldn't even put a shoe on. And then um, a few days later, um, it was in my right leg. So I could barely walk. I couldn't straighten the leg out. I was walking with a limp. So those are the issues that I've been dealing with. So they've ordered more MRIs. Prayerfully, um, it'll just take some going in and cleaning out the knee. Since I am getting up in age, I do know that I do have arthritis. Um, after doing several blood work with my rheumatologist, they did compare my autoimmune issue um, to lupus. Okay, so that's that's what... The first diagnosis was so I'm just pr praying that you know things get better and through diet exercise and stuff like that I can fix all these issues but anyways back to this girls trip I'm going on a girls trip and so I have come to trim all which I brought you guys to trim all on numerous occasions so I don't even think we need to you know vlog inside trim all they are on West timer this is the store that I um, come to when I'm looking for something quick to grab for trips or you know going out they have affordable fashionable items so i'm about to go in trim i'll see what they have and um if i grab something of course i'll show you guys what the new pickups are but let's go inside. all right so i'm back in trim all and y'all will be proud of me okay some of y'all will be very proud of me because if you know how i operate when it comes to packing for a trip it's usually the day the night before i'm supposed to board my plane and um, I can say again, this particular flight is a morning flight. I believe we board at 8 a.m. or something. So I have to be punctual with getting um, to the airport on time, especially because this time I am checking a bag. So I need to be there in um, a good amount of time to get all that done. But y'all will be proud of me because I have been in here. Today is Monday still, and we don't leave till Thursday. But I have already laid out outfits. And I feel like I'm ahead of the game. So let me go ahead and show y'all. And I'm going to show you the pickup that I'm most excited about from Trim All. Because I got some little some little stuff. Maybe a little dinner dress. But it's nothing spectacular. It's just something to throw on. And very light to pack. But I got this. 
I'm gonna describe it as a halter top utility jumpsuit in my favorite color. Um, and I didn't think it was gonna look like much because you should be in your favorite color. Sometimes it's not always um, complimenting as an outfit, okay? Just by itself, just pink by itself. It usually has to be, you know, combined with another color. But I have this halter top utility jumpsuit. Let me turn the camera and I hope I'm explaining it correctly. And it don't look like much off the hanger, but on, it look, it look real nice. Okay, let me turn it around. So this is it. All right, so, come on now, do right. So this part is the top, and these are the pants. See the utility pockets on it? I think that's what it's called. So the utility pockets, and then it has, in the back, it has like a low cut back and it has a zipper closure, and it's real cute on. So I was excited about that little purchase. And then um, I think I left the dress in the car only because I'm a little bit indecisive if I'm gonna take it back or not. And if you shopped at Trim All, Trim All has a five day return policy, so you better sleep on it. And if it's something that you think that you don't want, that you're second guessing, you better hurry up and take that bad boy back, okay? But um, I'm proud of myself. Like I said, I got accessories and purses on the couch here. I got glass, sunglasses and all that kind of stuff. My swim shoes and yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm getting it together. I am doing better this go round. So I'm proud of myself. But now um, I'm gonna leave this here because I have to teach class at 6.30 and it should be almost 6.30, so. Good morning, squad. Happy Wednesday. I am up on this good old Wednesday, and it is the day before departure, okay? So, yesterday, I was able to get a lot of things accomplished um, when it comes to uh, preparing myself to be ready to leave tomorrow, because I think I need to be at the airport, ooh, probably about 5 a.m., um, so I need to make sure I have everything done on today, and it's still early. It's not even 9 a.m. yet, um, but... I'm in here, and I showed y'all this pile on the floor the other day of me prepping myself, getting ready for the trip. But now the pile has since grown, and um, I ain't even going to be gone. I be acting like when I travel, I'm going to be gone forever, okay? We're going to be gone. Let me see. Uh, I come back on Monday, so I just don't understand why I be feeling like I got to pack so much. But I like to have outfits that I'm saying, okay, this is what I'm going to wear for Daytime, it's going to wear them from dinner. And then I have to have backups to those outfits just in case any type of wardrobe malfunction. Anything can happen. Like, I don't know, ripping your clothes, zipper bust, anything can happen. So I like to be prepared. So let me flip the camera and show y'all this pile because it has, grown, it has grown tremendously. Okay? Here we go. All right. So here we go. So as y'all can see, all of this, it, it, it's new. It wasn't down here first. Okay? But I got um, dinner outfits on this side. And then this is supposed to be in this little corner right here. Swimwear, nightwear, undergarments. Um, and then this is supposed to be um, like daytime wear. So little short sets, um, things like that. So I tried to separate it as best I could. But again... Some of this stuff, I just frisbee at it from the other side of the room. So, that's what I have going on, y'all. That's what I got going on this morning. I'm trying to, I guess, downsize this little pile because I do have a weight limit on my luggage. So, I'm trying to downsize this little pile. I'm trying to eliminate having to take so many shoes, trying to coordinate, you know, the same uh, some of the same shoes with different outfits, things like that. But um, I'll get to that when I get back. Right now, I'm headed to the nail shop. Um, I have to get a pedicure, eyebrows arched or waxed. And then um, I also am doing something different this trip, y'all. I'm getting my wig affixed to my head. Normally, y'all know on my vacation, I usually, um, you know, alternate my wig, switch from wig to wig. But this time, I think that's what I want to do. I think I'm going to get it um, glued down this time because I just didn't want to go through the hassle of having to switch out wigs. But again, I do like having the versatility of not having it glued down and I can take it off and switch and I become a different person the next day. So we'll see. We'll see how that works out. But anywho, let me get out of here. I hear the alarm going off. That means it's time to go. 
All right, y'all. So the first stop is the beauty supply. So I get like travel size um, hair care products so I don't have to carry my larger ones. And so I'm out of the spray that I use in my hair. And it looks like they didn't move the store around since I last been in here. So, you know, y'all can get like little travel, little cute size stuff. Especially if you are not checking a the bag. These are very helpful to carry because you know you can only carry a certain amount of liquids so these little cute little things I don't know why I say cute everything little I be calling cute but I don't see what I'm looking for let me put y'all down so I can give me some help around here yeah so I was looking all over stuff for this but here it is at the front so I got the travel got to be just in case the lace come up I can put it on back down and if I decide not to have it glued down then um, of course I'll use this when I interchange the wigs and I also got me a styrofoam head y'all I'm going to show y'all what I'm going to do with this alright y'all so I'm out of the beauty supply and I pulled up to the place where I get my eyelashes refilled now I just got my eyelashes refilled as y'all can see them last Friday so it hasn't even been one week that I've had them refilled but before I have a special event, before I go out of town, I like to get them done. Like, it's it's all a mind thing. It's all in my head. Like, even if she only have to add one, two, three, four lashes, I still like to come and go through the whole experience because it just makes me feel like I'm all the way together. Like, I'm all the way polished and looking the way I want to look. Now, I bought this styrofoam hair because we got to make a drop off. I drop off my wigs periodically to get tender loving care from my beautician. So wash, condition, reflat iron. So it looks brand spanking new. That's why I invest money into my hair pieces because they typically last me a very long time. Like I've had a wig um, that I had uh, custom made and it, I've had it for about eight or nine years. So all I do is drop them off, get them tender loving care and they back to new, back like normal, back like new. So that's why I don't mind investing money in a good um, made custom wig. Now these are for my bobs because normally what she'll do is she'll condition them, wash them, get them ready and she'll put them in a satin bag. I've noticed that my bobs don't um, quite look the way I like them to look when I put them on my head. So I drop these off so that she can put the bobs on the head. That way I take it from the head uh, the styrofoam head straight to my head and voila we back like it's new so that's what i had to get an extra styrofoam head because my other styrofoam heads are currently occupied right now y'all i have wigs galore i have wigs everywhere in that room so i'm probably gonna have a wig sale here coming soon so y'all stay tuned okay um but anyways let me get ready to walk up these three flights of stairs so i can get these lashes um together for tomorrow because baby Tomorrow is departure day. And y'all, I got to wake up at 4.30 a.m. I have to leave the house by 4.30 a.m. Actually, 4.15 a.m. So, y'all, let's have a moment of silence. Make sure I'm on time. All right, guys. So, lashes. Check. I can check that off the list. Y'all, I'm beginning to feel that feeling of I ain't going to be ready, okay? Even though this is probably... The only trip where I have been prepared as far as having all my outfits laid out, I guess what is uh, my dilemma is I feel like I'm going to overpack. I feel like I'm going to overpack because um, the itinerary is not set in stone. So we still, it's up in the air of the activities we're going to do. So your girl just got to make sure she's ready. But I am here at um, Tropical Cafe Smoothie. I told you guys about this place before. But this has become my favorite place. Like initially, I was just coming for them smoothies. And I was comparing them to Smoothie King, which I initially said I probably would prefer Smoothie King. But I've had the opportunity to try other smoothies that they offer. And they're actually good. Like they have a smoothie that has oats in it that I sometimes drink in the mornings. Then they have this smoothie called a Detox Island Green. So it's naturally sweetened. It has um, kale in it. It has fresh ginger in it. And so it's real good for you. So I found that it does help with my digestive system. So I come pretty much, I would say I drink this maybe three times a week. But today, I also got a jerk chicken wrap, y'all. I'm not even over-exaggerating. Like, I don't know if it was the couple of times that I came before 
that I was just really, really hungry, but they have been pretty much consistent with um, making this wrap. And it has black beans in it. It has um, rice, of course, the jerk chicken sauce, the chicken. Um, it has a pineapple salsa. It's just good. So hopefully, as the times have been before, it has been good. Hopefully today is going to be good because it's going on almost 2 p.m. And I haven't had a morsel of food, so your girl is hungry. So we're going to see. Thank you. Thank you, ma'am. Have a good one. You too. All right, so we got the goods, okay? And it looked like the same girl was in there from the other day. So hopefully, it's about consistency today. Hopefully, it's just as good as it was the other day. We finna see. Hey, I can't even open the dog on straw. I'm breaking car rule one on one about not eating in the car. Okay, the way she cut it today was a little sloppy. However, as long as the taste hasn't been jeopardized, we good. All right. So we got cheese. Can y'all see that? We got cheese. We got rice. We got black beans. We got pineapple pico de gallo. We got jerk sauce. We got chicken. Oh my God. Again, she cut it a little sloppy, but that don't mean nothing. It's all about the taste. Yeah. She did that. All right, squad. What's up? It is Thursday. It is currently, what time is it? 6.48 a.m. I am at the airport. This is like my second home now. I'm sitting in the Satyrian Lounge with our thick bestie. Say hi, thick bestie. Hey, y'all. <laughs> and I'm struggling. I'm struggling, one. Wait, before I go into that piece, here is the headpiece that I told you guys about. Now, usually when I travel, y'all know that I bring several headpieces with me so I can interchange them out with the different outfits. This time, I was like, I don't feel like doing all that. So I wanted to have one um, bolted to my head. So I got my um, bow hole going on. Now this is not my first style of choice, but this is what works. It's cute, so we gonna roll with it. Now I did bring an emergency headpiece just in case we have a wig malfunction. I gotta be prepared. Um, but we are headed to Tulum. Um, we have a girls trip ahead of us, so we gonna link up with Pusha P. Lily, yours truly, and Kristen Alexis. So I'm excited, y'all. I'm excited because it's gonna be pure freaking ratchetness going on. Um, Gina brought Risha, please. <laughs> and from what I hear, we're gonna get lit with it because there's gonna be a lot of drinking, there's gonna be a lot of ass throwing. It's just gonna be a lot of ratchetness going on. I'm trying to tell y'all, prepare yourselves, get you a snack. Have you a seat because it's about to go die. But I'm tired, y'all. I didn't get a lick of sleep. Even though this is this is what bothers me, y'all. I showed you guys that I prepared, I started preparing my outfits at the beginning of the week. I laid them out in the floor. Accessories and all. And I still did not get no sleep last night. Not a lick of sleep. I I have stayed up all night. Like, I'm literally, that's where the struggle comes in. I'm literally struggling right now. I just told Gina I can lay over right now and just go to sleep. But out of fear of missing my flight, I'm going to go ahead and keep my eyes open. But I'm tired. I don't know why I get so much anxiety right when we about to leave. I feel like I'm either going to leave something. Then my luggage was over nine pounds. Just a whole mess this morning. But we here. And we got here early enough to get over here in the Centurion Lounge. That was Gina. That's Gina got here early, and I was able to skip her in line. The employee showed me a little grace because that line, baby, was wrapped around the building like we was participating in the Million Man March. That's how many people was in that line. But we got in, we in a satin lounge, and we board in about, we probably will leave here in what, about 30 minutes? A little bit less than 30. A little bit less than Okay, and the bar, the bar don't open till seven. I heard her; she wanted at least one mimosa. But uh, so we got ten minutes to the bar open. 
but we board at 810. No, we leave at 810. We start boarding at 7 something. So that's what I got going on right now. And y'all just sit back, hang tight, and stay tuned for the ratchet. First cheers of the girls trip. Cheers. <laughs> That's, 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 that's kind of bad. <laughs> Alright y'all, her in the building. She, hey, push, she pushing through. Y'all see that? Hey, she pushing through. I'm <laughs> get skinny out here. <laughs> yeah, we, we, what you say? You trying to be none, you waste none existing? Yes. You waste none existing. Oh no. And, and she on her way to it y'all. I see her in the flesh. <laughs> y'all, Kristen Alexis is here. We done made a business deal. So we was gonna get run apart, but you know we scared of that extortion shit. Okay, y'all not about to take all our coins, Ain't and we be out here high and dry Ain't. trying to shake a little tail feather with no. these knock knees shaking down here in Mexico. <laughs> Hell no. <laughs> Ratchetness has already begun, and all we doing is getting in transportation. That's all. Go ahead, Kristen. Thank you, bro. We getting in this Sprinter. This our driver. What's your name, mi amigo? Hello. What's your name? Fernando. Fernando. He gonna get us to the... <gasps> Where are we going? Hell. Well, first... Why I got in the car and I was about to say, damn. What? The, the steering wheel on the wrong side. Because <laughs> I just left... Because you Oosh. just left... Yeah. And I was like... We in our chariots. We are. The Sprinter. Yes. Child, we were sweating, Ooh, dripping. Profusely. Gosh, okay. God. Baby, I'm gonna go to bed. We in this AC. Oh, yeah, I'm about to go to sleep, I'm too. going to bed. I need a Not snack. Not sleep, bed. Wait. She said bed. Hi. I'm going to bed. Hi, Kristen. <laughs> hey, K-Stars. <laughs> hey. Okay. We ready to turn up this weekend? Oh, yes, we are. There's some some ratchet behavior. If you don't pull out a camera. Just a little bit. I ain't, I, I'm sick of her. Look at her. While she's slinging bag lady at me, where that damn camera? <laughs> Where's your camera? Oh, damn. Oh. You gonna okay. hurt your bag. Okay, Ariel. Okay. <laughs> I got, if I, let me find this camera in these camera pieces uh -huh, or these people so won't leave me alone. Gonna, she lied to us and told us the camera was down in that bag right there in front of her. And so she said it didn't have a battery, so I offered her a battery. Then she rejected the battery, which leads me to believe Ain't no camera in that bag oh, down there. What thing Porsche right. she gonna do is pose the is and she gonna twerk. Good, she gonna po in that order, she gonna pose and she gonna make that ass move. All I need <laughs> hey cutie with the big old booty. <laughs> <laughs> the gang's all here. Yeah. Y'all look so pretty. Oh, oh thank, thank you. you. I'm you so did ready. Too. I don't it has. Yeah, we had to make a little store stop to get some snacks. What you got? Vape. Nice. Vape. Oh, vape. vape. My bad. I don't need that kind, sir. What's up, boy? Oh, I have one. Thank you. We in a 7-Eleven. Gina, what you think? I No, Alright y'all, I got like me the other guy I a little ate. taco. Gina said it was mystery meat, but it's good. It's like beef and potato. That's why I said Why I didn't would... give us no bags? I don't they know. They I had said, them. do you have bag? He said, he looked at me and said, if we look gay they, they had them, um, <laughs> the black the girls. Uh, the hotel is Muahe. Hopefully I said that right. It is so pretty, y'all. It is so pretty. Views, views, views. This is straight out of the uh, transportation here. This is what we see. This is so pretty. Marshmallows. Yeah, it smells to aloe vera. That's a fresh essence. 
each one for each one for you can clean your hands you can refresh your head, your face, your neck. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. My pleasure. In each reservation, I will ask you please tell me. Así es, por favor. Make like and like this. So the uh, breakfast comes with it. Yep. That's uh, the only thing that is common is the breakfast. That's correct. Okay. Oh, that's a good time. So we need to be on time. Yes. 8 a.m. to 11 a.m. We got it. And you said, but it can also be brought to your room, right? Yeah. Okay. I will. For that reason, I ask you the. Hi, or I can share you the number for the room service. Thank you. Off to her room, to her so, boudoir. He's boudoir. taking her. Lily, let that man come back, okay? Okay. <laughs> Allah, thank you, Allah. He's strong. Okay, He's strong. So this is a hotel. We just have one restaurant and one bar. Okay. It's open from 8 to 10 p.m., okay? Okay. okay. It's the same time for the food. We also have a yoga class. Oh, the every pool is the same. Uh, yeah, hours? eight to ten years. Okay. okay. We you want to try yoga, yoga class? Class. Yoga class every day from. Let's try yoga. Nine thirty to ten thirty. Okay. Okay. We're gonna and try to bend ourselves up like Every princess. Thursday we have a meditation. Okay. The meditation is at six thirty. So if you wanna come today, today with us, yes. Okay. Six thirty. We we have that. You stay there, okay? You also have a little spa. Okay. Would you like a massage or something? You can, you can uh, arrange the massage with us. Okay. Okay. So don't be happy. Really? Don't be happy. Don't be happy. Don't be happy. This happy. is the best mirror to take pictures. This, the pictures do the room no justice. Don't be happy. Oh. Uh, you love pictures. your glasses too. Oh. Excited. All right, y'all. Uh, you just got us excited. Yes, I'm so excited. <laughs> Lily said the pictures don't show, do the room any justice. These are the rooms, y'all. These are how the rooms look. Like little teepees. Oh yeah, TP. Little hut. This is the room. Yeah. This is my room. Yeah. Can you try? Ah! Can you try open with your TP? Okay. Okay, think bestie. Oh my god. Okay, think bestie. Okay. Oh. I see you, friend. Ah! And this is her own little uh, sitting area. <laughs> That's your own little oh sitting god. area. Oh my, oh my goodness. This is very oh pretty. This is pretty. Getting real yeah. first reactions right here. This oh is nice. Not that that you smell it smells, it smells amazing. It smells like lemongrass and... Yes. It's an oh. special essence from Pardo of Mori. Oh, okay. Yeah, really? I'm so excited. This I'm so excited! Try to, try to keep all the concept of the Tulum. Uh-huh. You're gonna see everything in the jungle. Yes, I just was about to say with these trees, it's like I'm coming through the jungle. I'm so excited. Yeah, I'm excited, number one, because... I never would have dreamt I would have been in Tulum doing this. So I'm very grateful. I'm very thankful. I'm happy that God has granted us this opportunity. So the Most High has been very good to Look us. Look at hers. Look, Look at, at mine. You walk up to yours. I walk oh, up to mine. I love that. They must then know Auntie got bad knees. <laughs> Look from the oh, bed, I just, so this is nice. nice. This is nice. Got a little chest. Yeah. Oh, I gotta open it down. We usually clean the pool every day. Okay, let's try this again. Uh, it's red. Uh -oh. Green. There you go. Oh my goodness, this is nice. Look at Morning. this. This is very, very nice on my little oh, this bed. Is These are my views out into, oh my gosh. Oh my goodness. This is so nice. Yeah, I'm super, so look at Gina, the shower. The shower was huge. It's like out into the, the, where you can see the grass. Like, it's like, <gasps> this is so oh, it's nice. outside for real, for real. Yeah, it's outside for real. <gasps> it is no glass. No glass. No glass. This is outside shower. Oh my oh, God, my nature gets to see all my goodness. Yes, she's so cute. Yes, thank you so much. Oh 
Oh my God, look at the sinks. Ah! It's nice. I'm excited. Ah! This is freaking nice, so Jay. Nice. I'm about to start doing my little uh, routine of unpacking, getting my things a little bit more, I guess, um, easily accessible in here and getting a little bit more comfortable. Um, Y'all, yeah, I can always appreciate a room with a full body mirror, okay? The full body mirror. Yes, we need full body mirrors to get them angles. Get them angles when we get dressed. But um, I am, like I said, going to start getting a little bit more comfortable um, unpacking this luggage. I told y'all before, this luggage was nine pounds over. And watch, I don't use half of what's in there. So today was kind of a day where I thought we, well, we still got time. It's only 3.39. So this is day one. Um, it's only 3.39, and I think what we discussed was getting dressed and going to the pool and then eating dinner here at the resort for tonight. Um, so I think that's what the plan is for today. And I forgot the name of a club that Portia mentioned that we were going to M Club, M Lounge. Y'all already know. I can mess up a name. Y'all already I shouldn't even have to say that no more. But um, I think that's what's on the itinerary. Um, we did not have a actual set in stone itinerary. We kind of winging it, but we gonna make it happen. So um, let's start unpacking this stuff and then I'll pick y'all back up. All right, y'all, so I took me a little quick nap, but I am up for dinner. I'm a little bit late. I had to deal with a situation back at home, but got that handled and let me give y'all a look at the outfit for tonight. I will say at night, the lighting in the room is not that good, but this is the jumpsuit little snake print jumpsuit. I have she and accessories on, little ring, ring, little cuff bracelet. And then I have the Balenciaga Gucci collab bag, which is what I'll be carrying tonight. And I need to hurry up because Kristen and Portia are already there. So let me go. All right, y'all. So we are at the restaurant on the grounds of the resort. And what I ordered sound good. We gonna see if it look good and y'all know it's all about the taste. I ordered the one that had, um, it said brisket with caramelized onions and some kind of sandwich, yeah. With papa frita. Y'all, Lily went and meditated. That's why I'm still not dressed. And that's why she's still not dressed, yes. But I told Gina I want to do yoga. It's in the morning at 930. See if I can bend myself up like a person. Yeah. <laughs> that's what I just posted on my story. We took really? this picture. It's the only people who came. Okay. So we just kind of, thank you so much. Oh, yeah. Look at how many I got. Woo! Sure. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Good morning, squad. I am up. It's day two in Tulum. And um, I think the plan today is to go to the Cenote and some type of museum. Um, I'm not 100% sure of the name of it, but of course I'll get those details later. Y'all, last night we did not make it to M Lounge. That was part of the plan, but the plan did not um, happen because some of us went to sleep, which is okay with me because like I told y'all, the night before um, coming here, I got zero sleep. So I stayed up to about one or two packing, making sure I had everything. And we had to be at the airport so early, I needed to leave the house at 4 a.m. So I didn't even bother going to bed. So I slept about an hour and about 40 minutes on the plane. I slept about an hour and 45 minutes. Um, not an hour and 45 minutes, about an hour, I don't know, and 20 minutes on the commute from Cancun to Tulum because it's about an hour and 45 minute ride. And so I was playing catch up with my sleep. So um, I wasn't upset that we did not make it to M Lounge. But um, we are headed to the Cenote this morning. Um, I think they wanted to get there by the time it opened, which I think is at 10 a.m. So um, they do serve a breakfast here from 8 to 11. Uh, this is a free breakfast that comes with the booking. So uh, I think we're supposed to meet downstairs. I keep saying downstairs. I think we're supposed to meet out there about 8.30. Um, that's what I read in the group text. So um, that's the plan. Now, this is my little opinion about... Um, my experience thus far, if you have bad allergies, you need to come prepared. Bring your Allegra, Claritin, um, Zyrtec, whatever you take, bring your allergy medication. Also, if insects and th that's not your thing, then this probably wouldn't be the best option because Lily said she had a lizard in her room and y'all know I don't do lizards, salamanders, geckos, none of that. And it, bring your mosquito repellent, okay? The wood kind because the mosquitoes are out. 
Um, so that's my little rundown and my opinion thus far. But other than that, very beautiful, very nice. All right, y'all. So I am up. I'm going to give y'all a quick little outfit rundown. So this swimsuit is brought to you by Pretty Little Things. It's very cute. Has a little cow neck drapery here to camouflage the stomach if that's something that you would like to do. But it's open in the back, real sexy, real cute. I don't know where I got this cover up from. from. Shoes, Target. Earring, Forever 21. And yes, I said earring because I don't have one on this ear because the hair camouflages this ear. Uh, glasses by Louisville and hair by Plush Wigs and Styles. You can follow her on Instagram to see all her available units and the things that she does, um, services that she offers. She is having a back to school sale while I'm recording. I'm not sure if it'll be going on when this video is released, but go check her out. Also, if you're not following my um, LTK shop, the link is in my description box. So if there are links that I can include for some of these outfits that I'm wearing and you're digging these outfits, um, I will put direct links in my LTK shop. So make sure you go follow my shop in my description box. Now I need to head down to breakfast. Alright y'all, I, right, I made it down to breakfast. The beautiful Kristen Alexis is here. Hey. <laughs> <laughs> and we're waiting on the others. I thought I was the last of the Mohicans and I'm not. <laughs> Oh, oh look, I thought she was going to be last and she not. That's my dog. Not. <laughs> Y'all think best is not last today. Okay. Y'all think best is coming in all her glory. Look at her. She's so cute. Hello. Hi, guys. Hey, G. How are you? She's out here. Uh -oh. Push her. She pushing through in her cream and brown. Yes. Y'all seen Kristen. She's so cute. Yes. Girl, look at Wait a minute. Y'all seen her thick vest? Her thick vest oh, walking up. She just had a panic attack. She saw Sorry. <laughs> and yeah, Lily, oh, yes, truly. Yes. Yeah, yeah, I tried to, to save Lily from down, baby, because if she would have scooted back that chair anymore, she was going to roll down this hill. Okay? But there's Lily. She's doing her optic session. I want comment down below and let me know who y'all think was here on time. I want to start just... Yeah. Comment down below and let us know. <laughs> All right, y'all. So we have arrived at the Cenote. We are paying our entry. Way in. Y'all already know I ain't fucking with no Cenote. Y'all seen me in Cancun and it ain't happening again. Put your feet in there. That's about it. That's it. Oh. What she said? You gotta wash everything, including your hair. So you gotta completely wash your hair. You gotta take a shower and wash your hair. Because they don't want you to dirty up their water. Baby, I'm not washing this wig, man. Okay. Oh, I'll take a shower with my body. <laughs> Lily, <laughs> what you say, Lily? <laughs> I take a shower with my body. This wig gotta stay off for like three, four days. <laughs> for real? <laughs> I think you like. <laughs> oh, she ain't give me nothing. Hold on. You gonna give me a ticket? Thank oh, you. yes, you did. Thank you. <laughs> That's how discombobulated I am. I'm talking about we got a shower oh, from head to toe. Really. And this this week ain't gonna do that. <laughs> uh, the red building bathroom and the shower. Okay. The shower is completely mandatory. You shower her. Shower hair. Air, okay. Only for the swimming. Uh, okay. okay. They are definitely gonna make sure we shower. I'm definitely not showering my face. I'm definitely not showering my face. I'm not showering my head. Well, I don't feel like because I know the bottom of it's gonna get wet anyway. Well, you but the bright, bright. Yeah, you, you, you good, so you good. Yeah, yeah, this wig, this bow hole got to hold on till Monday. Oh my God. I ain't showering this wig. They gotta shower I'm not either. Sauce. I'm not showering my wig out. You know, they don't want y'all to get all that hair shit and they pretty <laughs> Hey, right that's fine. I'll okay. record y'all. I understand and I'm not against it. Yeah, so I understand. They what is, it is, is it a hair police? I'm not putting my face in. The fuck? I'm not putting so my hair. We not, we, yeah. we not swimming. I'm not swimming. We not swimming. Yes. No. no. Only legs. Yes. I don't know what he's saying. No. No. Yeah. No. Mm -hmm. No. Do you want to do right here? Just real quick. Yeah. yeah. Thank you. Oh, yeah, we got to go to the time out section because we didn't submerge our hair in that water, which I ain't. This wig gotta last till Monday. It's Friday. So, it is what it is.
They're trying to get scratched by nothing. All right, y'all. So this is the cenote, the forbidden waters that me and Lily can't get in. We took pictures at the first cenote, and then this is another one. But this one is more. I don't know, it looks more tropical, it's prettier. I like yeah, it. Yeah, it's very but beautiful. All right, y'all, so we have left the cenote and we are now looking for lunch. However, the taxi cab that uh, brought us over here brought us to the wrong spot. Yeah, they brought us to downtown and to not by the beach area. No, thank you. No, thank you. So now we are trying to figure this shit out. But in the meantime, between time, we're gonna head in this store and get some water. Cause La Poche, my little dry. Yeah, so we found a spot that has a pool. So we're gonna try to see where is a pool located in this restaurant. We're gonna check out the pool. That's what it looks like. y'all so we just finished eating lunch this was not the intended stop but we are in what they call downtown Tulum the name of the restaurant was Poppy Tulum and it was actually good we had tacos wings french fries the guacamole was amazing like the best guacamole I've had in a long time to be honest and they gave you a healthy portion of it you know like at Chipotle and things like that when you want guacamole they give you a little smidgen for four and five dollars when avocados don't even cost that much but anyways um, it was good, so I'm glad we stopped here and we had a great table talk. And now we're headed back to the room until tonight's outing when I'll pick y'all back up. This is probably the fastest I have ever gotten ready in my life. They literally text the group at 439. Could I be ready at 5 p.m.? So this is what y'all get today. For where we're going on the TikTok, the lady had on something very similar. So that's what was the outfit inspo for this evening's attire. We're going uh, with the jungle look. I know uh, the lady said, well, most of them anyway said they'll be in earth tones, which goes with the Tulum vibe. But y'all see the jungle I got to walk through? Baby, at night I come through running and screaming, okay? But anywho, I'm going to meet the ladies at the front. And I got to balance on these pebbles. So I'll pick you guys back up momentarily. He got a banana. A little monkey. Oh, 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 okay, y'all. So we are so in potheads put weed in your food. Hotel zone. Oh, well, we we just there. passed potheads, <laughs> and Portia said they put weed in your food. And then, but these are little different little shops, mm -hmm. different little restaurants. That was so dope. I don't that was so we came to watch the sunset. Well, Looks like it's called Zakik. I thought it was called something else. Wait, this is the. It's over here. Oh, okay. That's the I'm store. Like, gotcha, because I'm like, I thought it was called something else. All right, so we came to see the sunset and do the little museum. It is definitely a vibe. Definitely mine to take these flowers off. Okay, I'm trying not to come sliding down. Okay, baby, this is difficult to walk on in flip flops. I feel like we need a tissue. Ooh. I said be careful. <laughs> we just go up. I'm gonna let you go a little bit. Baby. Yeah. Is it steep? No. no. It's just a lot of them. Are okay, babe. I don't know about this. It's I don't know about so cute in here. Right. Mm -hmm. It is so Stairs that we have to take to get up here. 
Now let me put y'all down so I can hold on. The margaritas. Thank you. Right? Okay. It, guys. Thank you. You want more drinks? Or you want some food? Remember, I open a tap and then a start. Thank you. Uh, more drinks at the party. Oh, yeah. Christina got down here on his neck and dropped her glasses. What are you at? And then we've come here and we've got one more week left. Okay. Are y'all staying in this, this hotel for the whole week? Well, we've already been here since Tuesday, so we leave Sunday. It's been oh, beautiful okay. here. Wow. It is. It's very yeah. beautiful. It's so yeah. nice. It is. But I was going to say, like, all you guys are she's trying to sound like the woman. Me? What the uh, hell is wrong with her? Are traveling to Australia? Yes, of yeah. course. Yeah. Yeah. You have to come to Melbourne. You have koala bears and um, kangaroos. Yeah. You ever seen a kangaroo? No. That, that, that doesn't happen. And there's no snakes in the toilet. Portia is American as well. Really? No, that's what, what I said. No. <laughs> <laughs> Do you just see koalas like in weed? No, that. So, so your kangaroos don't be squaring up? No, no, no. That's I not going to happen. Portia, that's because on the video, they, they be fighting. On they be do. They do be fighting. They be fighting. There's no kangaroo jacks happening. No. That's not happening. Because I thought I was going to come and have to fight a kangaroo. Yeah. Babe, there'll be some husband. Thank you. Me and Gina are splitting a meal be, since we're not that hungry. You don't so this is the club sandwich. Just take they your bread and I did not get to have it because I had some kind of brisket coffee. situation. I didn't put but I'm excited. They got we got manners over here. Bread, though. A little confused about that, but it's all about the taste. Let's see what it tastes like. You know, I don't eat mayonnaise. You don't eat mayonnaise? Mayonnaise. Can I have a mayonnaise sandwich? Family. If you don't eat mayonnaise, you like 
My daughter eat it. Now this it. one has the seasoning on it. Yeah, yeah. You taste the seasoning mm -hmm. now? Mm-hmm. Then bitch be fried. Because I asked yeah. myself, is it the flavor, the texture, what is it? I just don't like the way it looks. Like yeah, so we just got to Lily's yeah. room. And she got the biggest yeah. room out of everybody. Yeah, this is lit. Wait, wait, okay, wait. mine is... Wait, wait, wait. Yours is smaller, though. It is. Is way bigger. Than I need to see yours because you. But look, her shower is so big. Okay, so you see how she got these like. What? She got a what? That's what I said. What's this one? They, they, you can have a joining room. Yeah. Oh, Wait a this, this a but her outdoors. And her mirror not as dirty as mine. No. <laughs> the layout of her room. I love the layout. I need to see yours. It is. Oh, it is outside. Yeah, to the left. Oh, sorry. Yeah, this is cute. But it's so hot, y'all. Okay. I mean, my bathroom So this is where we will be holding uh, Carisha Place. So we have 20 minutes to get it together. And don't go to sleep, Kristen. It's about to happen. Portia's reading the instructions. Um, the deck consists of three categories. One, take a shot. Players will take shots. Wait, everybody. Got a shot glass. This is amazing. Marisha Roulette. Players will take. Don't drink and drive. Don't, we, we ain't driving, but we got to walk through the jungle to get back to the <laughs> room. The youngest person go first. It ain't me. It ain't me either. show your pussy or dick right now. <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> 
She not gonna use a cup. Oh, we said we was gonna try to. Baby, because we got a whole deck to go through. Yeah, look how big that is. Yeah, take that. Cheers. Half a breaking curfew. Kristen take. Kristen taking her shot. Yeah. It ain't even coming out. I opened it. Well, I didn't open it. Open it. I've never seen this before. What is that? You ever seen it? Yeah, that's like the it's it's supposed to come out. It was coming out, but it was slow. It was yeah, coming out. It out real yeah. Slow. Oh, it is. Yeah, it was coming out. It just come out real slow. Oh, like, oh there it goes. Okay. Yeah. Thank you. Oh, really? Like, no, it wasn't. Okay, what time are we supposed to be up? Cause uh. It was after Christian. Look, that guy. We got all deep feelings. <laughs> no, I'm not. No, I'm not. Who was after Christian? My me. My turn. Okay, Gina. Wait a minute, what happened? Why? I can't even read it. <laughs> I dare you to text your ex, I miss you, babe, or take three fucking. And I can do that. Look at that. I can do that. I can do that. Look at that. Wait, what did you say? Let me pick the ex. Let me Okay, what you gotta say? I miss you, babe. Right? Babe, I miss you. He on his, what I miss you. He on his way to Tulum. <laughs> <laughs> he gonna say, quit playing. He on his way to Tulum. Let me see. You can see. Yeah, we can see. I'm about to just see. You scared? Wait, come on. You can't hear see. Jennifer said, you scared? I'm trying to deliver it. Oh, my God. Okay, I. Your bank account and show your show your balance. Oh, or I take know. three shots. Here, take the three shots. Dang, three? Damn, three shots. I three shots. Trying to kill us. The girl, the oh. three shots is wild. Like three. that's trying to kill us. That is wild. Don't try to rewrite the rules. The rules are the rules. Look, what you doing? Think about what you doing? Oh, we gonna show like that. Okay. 
On one leg. On one leg. We just got reported hey, got saying that we too loud. And and this fool got up and ran to the. <laughs> Come on, I push her. I was gonna make it. I told you. I, I seen somebody over there when we first moved. So we got Good morning, you guys. It is day three here in Saloon. I literally just rolled over, picked up the camera to talk to you guys. Last night we had fun. The game is not what I expected out of the cards, like the situations. A lot of the cards were sitting around scamming, which none of us have done that. But um, we had fun just congregating together and just laughing. We had fun. Yeah, I've been hungry, though, since last night. Very hungry. And today is the day that we decided to sleep in, and then we'll get up and go to brunch. But I ordered room service because I don't think I'm make it. Like, I am, my stomach feel like it's touching my back. But anyways, y'all, I am having a good time here in Tulum. Um, I didn't realize until Lily said it last night, I guess because we've been so busy and just on the go since we got here, that the rooms don't have no TVs in it. Not that that's a problem for me, but they don't. But I do believe, like, you can come to Tulum for a girl's trip. You you definitely can because it's so much to do. Um you can always resort to TikTok, you know, to build your itinerary. But it is a lot of things to do here. Um, I just feel like this particular resort is more of a you and your boo type situation, like a vacation, the way that it's set up and everything. Um, but that's just my opinion. Um, other than that, y'all, I have really been enjoying myself. It's always refreshing when you can hang with a group of ladies and it's no bickering, you know, um, we get along, we can engage in conversation almost on any topic, and um, it's just, you know, no no hating, no jealousy, no envy, no none of that. Like, we just really um, blend. Like, we all are like a piece of a puzzle that fits, and that's just refreshing. So, I've been having a good time with my girls. Um, it seemed like this was way overdue, like... I hadn't seen them in forever, but um, I'm glad that we are all here. And I did not already put in my order through WhatsApp for them to bring me um, my little French toast because that French toast Gina had the other day looked amazing. So I'm excited about eating because your girl hungry. Good morning. I got breakfast call. We got French toast and cappuccino. Okay, you need to sign first. Okay, y'all, this French toast looks amazing. This is why I had to get it. Because I was staring at Gina's yesterday. Whipped cream. Tastes like a little strawberry puree. Good. Alright, y'all. So, this is the outfit for today. We are doing brunch and taboo. I took my tag in right here. We going with neutrals. Hold on, somebody at the door. Hola. Oh, thank you. Is the cleaner room one? No. No? Mm -mm. Tomorrow? It's maybe tomorrow. Okay, okay thank you. I tried to get a do not disturb sign. When I'm on vacation, I really don't like them to clean my room when my room is in a disarray and I have crap everywhere. But anyways, outfit for today, we got on neutrals. If I can get this chair out of my way. And this mirror, I don't understand these little splatches. That, that guess that's part of their decor situation, but it's on all the mirrors here at the resort. But anyways, okay, focus. We have on neutrals. So I have on a brown swimsuit from Fashion Nova. Shorts from TJ Maxx, as well as this, I don't know what you call it, like a knit poncho from TJ Maxx. It has different shades of brown in it. Wicker looking purse is from Shein. Shoes, of course, Shein as well. Glasses, Versace headpiece, plush wigs and styles. And I'm headed to, I think, Bestie Room so I can have me a morning cocktail. That's cute. 
Thank you, thank you, y'all. I came over to the bestie room. I came over to have a cocktail. Because y'all know if one thing she gonna do is have a morning cocktail, okay? Damn. Is. And she already went in and I just got here and it is. Oh, it's not that I early. I you OJ. You did? It's amazing orange juice. Look, she ready, y'all. I should look cute in her go. Go, Lemay. Go, go. Look at my trophy. <laughs> okay, I'm, trophy. I'm about to be a trophy wife. <laughs> Trophy wife. Okay, speaking it into existence. That means I'm gonna be a bride's what? Bridesmaid? No, oh, maid of the, honor. Which one have to be married? The matron or the maid? Matron of honor uh, is the married one. Married one and maid of honor. It don't matter what she is. Okay, I'm gonna be the maid of honor. Yeah. Hey, friend. Okay, here we go. You want oh, you tea though? I bought that little one from the other from the store too. Oh, drink that one. Try that one. This one? Yeah. How about this little? This little Yeah, you'll see how smooth that one is. Okay. Let me sit y'all down and prepare this. <laughs> prepare the queen's drink. Prepare. Ooh. Yeah, I was trying to do something. Y'all see this? Cute with this little... I don't even know what you call it. A poncho? What the hell is poncho, it? Poncho! That's what it is. A swim... But it's, it was in the swim section. Oh, hold on. I was thinking about tying it around here. But then I said, that looks, it creates like an artificial sleeve, I guess. A faux sleeve, <laughs> if you may. No, do it tight in the front. Oh. I think that's cute. Mm -hmm. Oh, it's constricted. Yeah, like I can't. But that'd be cute if you know if I feel like what's the move or something. I can't do it like I want to do <laughs> Okay, it actually is not that bad. It is extremely smooth, surprisingly. And y'all know I don't even like at all, but this is good. No, don't say that. Hey, you guys. So I am out of the room with the ladies. We got Hi. Kristen and we got Pusha. Pusha always got to do it. <laughs> we finna do an outfit check, okay? Pusha gonna have a... Why she twirl from around the corner? She always extra. Because I was on my way up there. Oh, okay. And then you call my name. No! All right, y'all. We doing an yeah, outfit check. Down. Up first, no. we got Lily. Oh, hey, y'all. So outfit check. Okay. Um, this cover up is from She In. This swimsuit is from Pretty Little Thing. Um, flip flops, Target, Marnie bag, and then my Chanel glasses that I wear all the time because I love them. <laughs> okay, cutie. Put the big out booty. Hey. Up next. Coming to the stage, oh, wow. Kristen Alexis. <laughs> I'm wearing fashion now, y'all. Just, just a little set or whatever, and then I got on my little um, lounge swimsuit. Here okay. Okay. <laughs> okay. Um, my, uh, my Louis, and then I got my little glasses. And okay. Period. Okay. 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 Cute. Cute. <laughs> Cute. Y'all so silly. <laughs> Up next, she, she pushing. She pushing P. Okay. She pushing. Y'all gotta get the little theme music. <laughs> okay. Um, my swimsuit is from Shein. My little cover up is from Shein. I have my Gucci glasses and uh, and um my Dior sandals and period. Period. Yes, world for the girls and the girls. Okay. <laughs> Coming to the stage, we got Almond. How do be coming out? Almond. How do be kicking their thighs? <laughs> we got Almond. Oh, yeah. Outfit check. Watch your, Watch your head. Oh, yeah, because it's, yeah. Outfit check. Outfit check. Baby suit from Crazy Boys for $7. Period. My little shorts, $5 from the little fast fashion store in Houston. Period. Duster from Forever 21. Period. Bag from Didi's Dee Discount. Period. Glasses are Chanel. You know, Period. you can mix the highs and the lows. Chain from Didi's Dee Discount. I love that chain. Thank you. Earrings from Shein. 
Yes. Period. Okay, y'all, outfit check. Yes, I have on a swimsuit from Fashion Nova, shorts from TJ Maxx, shoes from Shein, bag from Shein, earring Shein, glasses, Versace. Yes. Where that shawl from? Oh, TJ Maxx. TJ Maxx. Oh, I love that. TJ Maxx. Yes. <laughs> Okay, so we are sides for today. We are at our first stop, which is Del Silo, a tropical bistro. If you can see the name up there. Where is this? Yeah, I see it. I see there we go. It looks like a little tropical setting. Cute. Real cute. Alright y'all, so this restaurant looks like it's more on the healthy side. As you can see, it says healthy, organic. So the options are usually something on the more healthy side. They do smoothies, bowls, omelets. And there are also some TikTok videos you can refer to if you want to see more. But let me decide what I'm going to pick out this meal. Baby, just uh, when I say a, I don't even know if you could say a pinch of orange juice. No, it's not. Even oh, no, it's not. I like it's more chilled more, but. Mm -hmm. I would take three. I, take, I always go over you can take, my way. You can, I go over. You can I take, take three. four. Like the other guy, the ball right. head. Right. He got a big one. He has avocado in there. there. Okay. It's crazy because some before the Netflix wedges. show came out, before the Netflix show came out, they should be. So the food is at the table and I asked for ketchup and he said this is homemade ketchup. Look at the consistency. Homemade ketchup. It's kind of like watered down. Kind of. I'm not used to the consistency, but it's all about the taste. It wasn't because of the show. I we should have been with it. Oh. It's super sweet. It's sweet. It's sweet. Mm -hmm. It's ketchup. Homemade ketchup. Oh, I was going to ask them what the kids were doing. That's what you get. I need mayo. Oh, that's lychee. And mango. Black. Yeah, that's all I want. But he don't got one with both. Oh, lychee and mango. Oh, I didn't see it. What is it? It's just fresh it's mango. It's awesome. They getting some fruit, guys. Some lychee. Lychee, lychee. Oh, he got it on ice. Come on now, on ice. Yes. This pongo is spicy? No spicy. Oh, no, 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 no. Can you turn it across the ice? Y'all, I hope this fruit's sweet. She in, baby, Girl. for the win. She in for the win. Yeah. fire. Oh. All right, so we have arrived, you guys, at Taboo. See the sign right there? So we about to do this little beach club experience here in Tulum. I'm on one side of the street. The girls on that side. Here they come. Baby, you gotta haul ass across the street or be run over. They, they be coming full, full, full speed. All right, y'all. So we got a bed and table. Music loud as hell, but we ordered our bottles. We chilling.
for about 30 to 40 minutes i kind of had a slight headache um but i was also ordered me some room service so i'm having the beef tacos i didn't eat two of them i'm having the beef tacos and some kind of i don't even know what this is it tastes kind of like a custard with macadamia nuts and fruit it's a little dessert i wanted just a bowl of fruit but room service said that it's only served in the morning so that was i had a little sweet too so that was the next best option um, but y'all, we had a good time in Taboo, okay? So if you are in Tulum, put that on your to-do list. Taboo was a whole vibe. Now, I will give you a rundown of what I can remember of the prices. So um, if you book online, um, this is what was told to me by Pusha P, then you can get like um, a beach chair or whatnot. Um, I don't know if it's free or if it's for a lower price than any of the other seating. But if you book online, you might want to, try doing that if you're trying to do the most cost efficient way of the taboo experience the next option was a table the tables were i believe 700 if you can uh, once we converted it to u.s currency it was 700 then they had um kind of like a i don't know bed but it was directly in the sun it didn't have too much shade that was a step up which was 900 then they had kind of a bed that was closer toward the pool area which was 1800 which was the area where we were and then you could have did a cabana which was um in the two thousand dollar range um the good thing about where we were the monies that were paid went toward food and drinks all the money so none of the money was wasted had we selected to get a cabana which was in the two thousand dollar range that half of it went toward food and drinks and then the other half was just your cover charge to get in so i think we did the best option to get more bang for our book um we had a good time and as y'all can see that bridal party they had a damn good time the bride lip was busted um they are from texas from austin texas actually she's getting married in october but baby we had a good time today was definitely one for the books and the day is not over like i said we came back to the room i ordered room service i laid down for a little bit and now we are going to prepare ourselves to go back out while we were at taboo we met a gentleman who um stated he moved down here and he opened up a club called toxic which is directly across the street from taboo so that's where we're going to go tonight um and yeah that's that's what we got going on it is currently a little bit after 10 it is 10 08 we supposed to be downstairs at 11 o'clock we gonna see who gonna be on time because i ain't gotta do much but rip this bunnet off my head and throw my clothes on because i'm not i'm not doing too much just put it like that but anyways of course you guys will get to come along with me for the experience at toxic so we'll see how this how the night ends up and this is the look for tonight's outing i don't believe everybody's going though i think Kristen is a little bit tired, and Lily is not feeling her best. So I hope she starts feeling good soon. Um, but this is the look for tonight. Let me turn y'all around to this mirror. I have on a two-piece from Shein. Of course, I will put the link in my LTK store. Um, I have a gold bag from Amazon. This is my Fotega. I have on gold shoes from Zara. 
I have on go accessories. Everything came from Shein except the necklace. I can't remember where that's from. And then head pieces by Plush Wigs and Styles. This is your girl's look. I will say the two-piece set was um, inspired by Pusha P. She wore, I think, a yellow one somewhere we went. I can't remember where. I think it was Cancun. But um, this is my look for tonight. And um, yes, so now let me go see if everybody else is ready. This is the gang that came down to go out. This is the, who gonna keep the party jumping tonight. Oh, yes, sir. <laughs> oh my God. Mm -hmm. We are sitting here waiting on them to call us a, ca a cab. Um, where we going? Toxic. Toxic. It's a ride across Toxic. from Taboo. Near Taboo? Yeah. yeah. Across the street. Baby, it sounds like it's a task over there calling this taxi. Try to hustle us to take us home. Porsche over there negotiating to get us a good rate. Look at them. <laughs> hey y'all, so I am up. I'm out of my bed and I am prepping to go meet uh, the girls at the pool. Y'all, we have yet to enjoy the pool here on the resort ground. So we do have um, a pool party that we'll be attending at, I believe it's four o'clock. But we elected to kind of take it easy today and enjoy the pool here on the grounds of the resort because we had not done it yet. But yeah, I'm digging having this unit bolted to my head because it is just so convenient. All I got to do is come in at night like I did last night and I was dog tired and just throw my money on and go to bed. Now, don't get me wrong. I do like the versatility of having the different units when I travel, when I, you know, change my hair pieces because I can choose a color. I can do my ash blonde. I can do my jet black. I can choose different textures, things like that. So I do like that too. But this here just offers me so much convenience that I'm like, yes, I ain't got to do all that. I can just go to bed, wake up, get up, get these a little sheen, a little leave-in conditioner, a little water, and then I'm out. But today's look is another fabulous Shein. Hold on, let me adjust y'all a little bit. We got another Shein swimwear, swimsuit, monokini situation. I feel like it's kind of big. But anyways, this is what we're wearing out. And um, yes, once I get out there, I'll bring y'all back. Let me finish prepping so I can hurry up. All right, y'all, so this is the final look. I have on, of course, a Shein swimsuit I just showed you guys. I have on a pink swim cover-up. It's a tad bit long, which I told y'all I'm fun size. Five foot, four and a half. Then I have on these black knotted Tarjay slippers with some Chanel shades. And then the gold accessories you've seen the whole trip. And I'm headed out. Yeah, we came out at the... Same time. And she got a cocktail ready. That lady be ready. I'll be ready. I'll be, be ready. Wake up Let's see your now. swimwear. Is this a surprise? No, it's just a denim bikini. Oh. Denim from Target. Oh, I can dig the denim. Denim bikini. I can dig Lord the denim. Shades. And then my bag from Diddy's Diddy. Discount. Yes. yes. I love your duster. Thank you. Or whatever it's called. Cover up. It's a swim cover up. Yeah. It's cover up. Cover. It's a boohoo. It's a boohoo. <laughs> hey y'all, hey y'all, look at Pusha. Thank you, welcome to the party. Pusha, push it through. There go the ladies. Okay, we have oh, I like them little H and M slides. Them cute. We have those. You don't I have don't those? have those. I sent you the picture when I bought them, and I said you need to buy them. Did I literally you? sent you the picture. Yes. Did you? I have these, but they're. Yeah, look. They're this. in brown. Yes, these exact same ones. And Are you sure you sent it to me? Ago. Or did you send it to someone else? I'm almost positive. So, yeah, she Tina. can no longer, she can no longer say. So picky. She can no longer say, I've known Jen for 27 years and we haven't had a disagreement. This is our first disagreement. <laughs>
<laughs> no, you see me. <laughs> we weren't drunk. We went to Lily room trying to get in. We was running from the taxi cab driver. She didn't open the door at all. She yelled out from her bed. You know, she probably thought it was going to be. I think we always stayed out welcome with Carisha Blaze. No, no. Yeah. We always stayed out welcome, so she said, I ain't, I ain't going for that shit no more. <laughs> Them hoes got to go home. <laughs> You ain't gotta go home, but you can't come here. We overstayed our welcome when we played uh, Risha, play, Risha Roulette. So that's why she was scared of. She was scared we was coming to State of Three and Four. Oh, she didn't wanna get put out? Yeah. When she get put out, she got four other rooms. She got four rooms, little do they know. Little do they know. Like they thought we was all sharing a room. Oh, when we first. Yeah, if you get put out your room, we got four other ones. Oh, hell do. Yeah. Do. Their clubs are like Y'all know I love Mr. Kevin Gates. No, that's my baby. I love Kevin Gates. Kevin Gates is awesome. I was telling them I didn't buy these because I was like, Wait, what is this? That's Jennifer. Oh, that look good. You want to see it? This is that. He's like, oh, yeah, you can get one. I said, hold on. Oh, it's like a little bit of a salad. Gina said it was good last night. Yeah, I had a little bit of a salad. I had a little flow thing. Mm -hmm. So when I turned all the lights off, see the man like the heel over there. Blinking. You can have a heart. You want a heart? Because I'm going to eat it like this. Oh, that's the way to do it. Yeah, we outside. We outside. We pulled up to M. Talon. It was supposed to be a pool party. So we're dressed in all our blue, all our blue, all our pool party, all, all our pool party attire. For our, but this is really for an optic session. It really is yeah. for pictures. Yeah, it's for pictures. So that's what we have on. But I don't think it's a, it's what we expected. So we about to go in and see. Y'all see me in my four-way vest? My four-way vest and my... This swimsuit was we under... I think this swimsuit was $6. Yeah, she in. Y'all saw I'm back. When I got to the room, camera dead. Okay, so I had to charge up a couple batteries before we leave for tonight's outing. But this is our last outing in Tulum. I've had a wonderful time. Today was a good day. Um, we did our little optic session with our baby blue. And we also went to that Tulum M Lounge, which I showed you guys. Um, so they have something on Instagram, I believe it's called Black in Tulum, where they have various events for um, different days of the week. So if you're ever in Tulum, I would encourage you to look that up. The M Lounge that we went to, I think we kind of misinterpreted the advertisement, and that's our fault, because we thought it was actually like a pool party, a big pool party, but it's actually like a little restaurant lounge, and it has a pool in it, a small pool in it. Um, cute for pictures and you know for the experience but it wasn't an actual pool party like we thought it was but we had a good time um now this is the look for tonight so we are going with browns and nudes we have this brown sitting against this melanated skin and i know we're gonna look good like we do and um let me show y'all my outfit let me sit y'all up now the lighting is a little bit dark in here but this is the outfit I have on a bandage dress, Fashion Nova. It has openings down the side, very low cut, very sexy for dinner. Um, it accentuates all your lovely curves. I also have it in a different color. I have it in white as well. Same accessories that I had on the entire trip. A little Shein, cheap little accessories, nothing over $3. Um, the necklace I've had for a long time, not sure where I got it from, but this is the look for tonight. If you need a fragrance, we need a fragrance. We need a fragrance. All right, so 
I usually don't travel with my larger bottles of perfume only because it adds extra weight to the suitcase and I don't want them broken or anything. So we have some little travel fragrances. This is the same person that makes Baccarat. And so we are going to give ourselves a little squirt here, squirt there, squirt, then take it under, bam, bam. Now we smelling good. Now I'm out. Yeah, these are night views. The pool looks so nice at night. Doesn't it? It looks amazing. It is so beautiful. The trees. It looks so pretty at night. Just to lay out here and relax. Look like I'm the first one down here too. Alright you guys, so we are at Bach Prime Steakhouse for dinner. Our last outing um, here in Tulum. We just got hustled in this taxi. And y'all, the reason we did a taxi is because um, at the airport, this guy told us a horrible story about them getting ex extorted. Extorted. I can't even say the word. So, we chose elected to have taxis to take us around. But here we are. We're at Bach Prime Steakhouse. From the TikTok videos, it looks like a vibe. It looks like a vibe from the TikTok. So, I'm excited. I've been excited the whole trip. I've had a good time. I know I said that already, but I'm going to say it again. I had a good time. Walk through the jungle. Lily is meeting at 4 a.m. Bye, Lily. Oh, goodbyes are always so sad. Push it. Push it. She's pushing me. Lily is leaving early as fuck. Cause who the fuck told Lily to put her flight at six? Eight summits. Yeah, whatever. For the kids. Yeah, I can I can understand that. Oh, okay. Oh yeah, and she got a drive. Baby, this is a dark walk through the jungle. Yes, very dark. It's very dark. Yeah. Get your mind out the gutter, baby. Oh. All right, Jennifer, did you say something? I ain't said nothing about that. Sure. <laughs> That's what she thinking about. Her mind is in the gutter. Oh, you can't even see nothing. Oh, there I go. All right, go pack, friend. All right, y'all, so I am back in the room. We are back from dinner. That place was extremely nice. Very, very, very nice. It was a vibe. Music was good. Um, I can say some of the food dishes were good, and that's going to be expected from any restaurant. Some restaurants, you're going to have your good dishes, you're going to have your bad dishes. But um, what I had was the lobster ravioli. I was a little disappointed. It was like... Um, I don't know, too tomato-y. But anywho, everything else about it, amazing. I had a very good time with the ladies. Y'all saw we had to say goodbye to Lily because she is leaving at 4 a.m. The commute, remember, from Tulum, where we are, back to uh, Cancun, where the airport is, is about an hour and 45 minutes. And her flight is like 8 some in the morning. And she has to be there early to check her bag because it's an international flight and blah, 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 blah. So we leave shortly after her at 6 a.m., um, because I think um, Pusha and Kristen are next up to leave, and then me and G are the last ones to leave. So we had a fabulous time here. Y'all ain't gonna miss bathing outside though. It was a it was a creepy crawler out here earlier, and uh, yeah, I almost did not get to shower because it was gonna be either him or me, and I choose myself. Anywho, let me get this situation I got going on 
I kind of started packing, but I still got a little more to do. So I'm going to put the camera down so I can take care of this and try to get like, I don't know, I could probably get about three hours of sleep. So, All right, y'all. Good morning. After that long, drawn-out checkout process back at the hotel, our driver was kind enough to stop at the Tulum sign so we can get a picture. There it is. Kristen bought this little bitty bag so she doesn't have to check her bag. So this is the end. What happened? No space. This is it. Oh, Lord. Bye, Kristen. It was so much fun. Bye. Thank you. Yes. Thank y'all so much. Have a safe trip. Thank you. Yes. Message me when you guys get home. Okay, will. I will. We're gonna message in the chat. Okay. All, All right. right. Safe travel. Say bye for sure. Until next time. Until next time. I'm coming to Houston. I don't even know. Y'all, I'm leaving. My cousin's son. Tell me about Y'all gotta go to my gate. I don't know when next time I'm coming. I probably won't come to September. September? Yeah. Okay. September. And then my mom's gonna be my mom's birthday. Oh boy. Oh, the fuck. Oh, we could not. So I am getting ready to leave the VIP lounge here at the Cancun airport and head over to our gate to board our flight back to the H. I had a wonderful time with the girls in Tulum. It was definitely one for the books. We turned up. I talked about the pros and cons of the different venues, the hotel, and all that kind of good stuff. So I hope you guys enjoyed the footage. Um, and this will be the end of my travel vlog. So until next time, as always, thank you for watching my content and I love you guys.